Do you realize the arms you put around my waist were squeezing the life from my body? Like a snake waiting patiently for its prey to suffocate. You pulled me close in the night. Justifying my suffering, you claim without me you would die. Would you die without my flesh in your belly? Would you die without devouring my hopes and dreams like honey? Would you die without the drink of my tears on your tablets? Your empty promises keep me calm as you hold me tighter and tighter, and soon the skin that used to glow is gone ashen from your tender care. I can't feel my fingers or my toes. Is this even hurt? Are you saying I love you? By the time I've forgotten how the whisper of true love sounds, you've grown fond of this position. Your arms coil around me and you start your twisted game. Your breath so near to mine, there isn't enough oxygen here. Lips dance across my ear, feeding me lines that my mother warned me about. Too blind to see the reality, I happily marinate in my new habitat. It's warm here. It's cozy like a nest. You won't hurt me, isn't it true? You protect me, you feed me, you... You water me. When your lip curls and you spew poison, it begins to look like I love you. Maybe I'm wrong about I love you. Maybe they are supposed to burn and bruise. The marks remind me of your love when you sleep. I can't breathe. This hurts. I want you to let go now, please! Please. Surely it was the hand of God that broke my spell. Your game designed to distract and then attracted my attention to your actions. Sputtering and squirming, I confronted a question. Your motive with a heart so pure, it would break there if they saw. Everyone knows. When you struggle, it gets worse. You sink deeper in the sand and the snake holds you tighter and your chances of survival fade rapidly. Surely it was the hand of God that pulled me from your grasp when you were poised to strike. Your teeth against my neck. Your ring at my finger. What I had once begged for, I now feared. Had you just one moment earlier, you would have had your fill. I would have given myself as a sacrificial lamb to satisfy your hunger. But now, now I'm healing. And these scars, these are new skin. Glowing and bright, new skin that doesn't tan or wrinkle or fade. Visual reminders of the beauty that lies inside of me. Reminders that roses really do grow from ashes. And reminders to my children to watch out for snakes to deceive which was games. And you, you are alone in the forest of your mind with only your poison and self-inflicted pain to keep you company. It is now time to go. These scars, they are new skin. Glowing and bright new skin that doesn't tan, wrinkle, or fade. Visual reminders of the beauty that lies inside of me. Visual reminders that roses really do grow from ashes. And reminders to my children to watch out. The snakes 